All right, we're here in Swansea, Mass. At the Sparrow Halloween, used to be a Toys R Us. You clearly see Jeffrey the Giraffe there on the welcome sign. And Holiday Studios, I am here because of you. One of my biggest fans who's always commenting and liking my page. He told me about four different times to come here. I'm finally here for you, buddy. Please enjoy. <laughs> Mr. Halloween. All right. He was right. He told me this place is going to be fully stocked, and I see everything so far. Finally, since the spirit store in Egg Harbor, I see a possessed pumpkin. If you guys don't know by now, this is the same exact model as Crouchy, the full size Crouchy. They just obviously designed them differently. <laughs> This store is full. I've been already around. Just took a quick tour before I walked in. This place is fully stocked just like the Egg Hobble location. So far, Holiday Studios is spot on what he told me. Exact, exactly like the Egg Hobble location. Not every store looks the same. That's why all us YouTubers go out and do this to catch out all the different displays. What's up, Bog Zombie? Oh, the chains fell off. This is for the selfie over here. They got a chain over there, but that one fell down. Oh, no. <laughs> he lost his inflation. <laughs> he lost weight. I'm a clown. Just in and around. You're a fool. Who's going down to hell? <laughs> <laughs> I really love this store. They did a great job. It's just like the flagship store. I compare everything to the flagship because that's the way it's supposed to be. There's my son. What are you being for Halloween, pal? Wait, it's right there. That's you. <laughs> what's his name? Frankie, what's his name? Come on. How do you not know Barry? That's Uncle Barry. That looks like it's not working. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Nope, not working. <laughs> now, this store is definitely really good. It's It's got every... All the lighted tubes with the bubbles. It's called the electricity bolts going through the sides. Those are the electricity bolts. There's Shorty. Oh, I love Shorty. It looks like he's uh, duck toed though. What's your favorite clown movie, pal? Clowns. What? Killer clowns. Killer clowns? <laughs> we have Shorty still at home from last year. We still haven't even opened them yet. You see this tombstone? I am not a fan of this at all. But I've been seeing a lot of videos online about it. How mailmen and UPS guys, etc. I've been going up on porches, and these have been displayed right on the people's porch. And this has been scaring the crap out of people. Feel free to go on yourself and check out. There's some funny videos of this. We're going to check if Monty's here. He's here. He looks a little weird. There's the rest of my family over there. <laughs> He's not working. Hello. Looks like his hips all misplaced over there. Mia, what's that? Mia, what is that? Look it. 
What is that? Is that a clown? Wait, they have the pie? Yeah, they have the killer clown's acid pie. I want to get it, but the other every spare home I go to, they, they look all mangled. I like a nice clean box. And this one's perfect. I'm going to get it. Yeah, pal, hold that. We're going to get that. Now, these right here, I got these this year. I put them on my car. They faded so quick. I'm going to take them off. That's how faded they got. Not happy about it. They look cool, and they are cool, but they don't last long at all. Same thing with Grim. I got him brand new in the box at home. I went to the flagship store. I grabbed him. I still haven't even took him out yet. One of my favorite of all time animatronics. So many movements. It's cool how the mouth moves with his actual words and his hips and his arm moves. There's just so much mechanics and it is, works perfect. Absolutely awesome animatronic. Who's that? Mr. Grim? Gotta go step on his thing. Go ahead. Go step on his step pad. <laughs> she keeps running. All right, let's take a look at all the animatronics they have here on the floor. All right. They got Straw Man. I have not seen him displayed yet at any store. I know he's in some spirits, but I have not found him yet. I actually really love Scarecrow displays. I'm a huge, huge fan of it. Got a lot of skelly bones. We got a Monty. Got some life-size posable skeletons. That black light reactive, it says. I haven't seen those. A fright in the box. Is that an inflatable? Yeah. Yeah, I don't like inflatables. There's that Tombstone of Terror I was just showing you. What's that? Lord Raven, that box has seen better days. My son's pointing out the Beetlejuice Groundbreaker Sandworm. I haven't seen those on anyone's lawn yet. Plenty of opposable dummies. A couple of shorties. Mr. Punchy. Wow, this place is loaded. They have everything. Let me tell you something. Holiday Studio wasn't lying. He told me to come here a few times. It's a little bit out of my way. It's like a 40 minute ride here from my house. But wow, it's worth it. They got two Mr. Punchies. I'm not a fan of Mr. Punchy, especially after seeing it all deflated over there. Some sitting scarecrows, mass produced scarecrows. I do own one of those. Got another Sinister Spirit, though. Oh my god. I have not seen this yet. A swinging witch. Oh, oh my God. Mia, look at that. It's a swinging witch. Is that scary? It is? Yeah. We gotta get that, don't you think? Yeah. Wow, that's awesome. We got a deadly creeper and Barry. Mia, who's, what's the scariest prop they have? Uh, Barry. Barry? <laughs> I think you just pointed at the first thing you've seen, honey. It's a witch. That's a straw man. I want that. The sitting scarecrow, daddy already has that. All the way in the back, they got a Grim. Some jumping spiders. What's this? And sinister dolls. My idea of scary is that.
not Chucky. Chucky's too cool to be scary. All right, we looked at all the animatronics on the floor. Actually, there's some more over here. They got Reagan. They have everything. Again, Holiday Studios, thank you so much for telling me to come here. I knew the way you were talking about it. It wouldn't disappoint, and it hasn't. This is so far the best spare Halloween I've been here. This is so far the best spare Halloween that I've been to. Is that a stuffed animal scully bones? Yeah. <laughs> hey, that fits your shirt today. That's the first regular scene in the store, I think, too. We are here at the back. And as always, we got to start off with Nozzles the Clown. Let's set him off. Is he working? I just booze with Halloween spirit. I also booze with all kinds of toxic stuff, too. Hey, pickle nose, raise your fog. I just love the industrial lights. All right, let's go inside the haunted house to see if everything's working. Looks like they have the floor here. Come here, honey. Come hold daddy's hand. All right, the displays are definitely working. We'll see if we go in here, if the floor vibrates and these turn on. Oh, they turned on. The floor is not vibrating though. <laughs> Just so you know, I was acting a little funny in the uh, scene before because see this display? My son decides we're gonna to lean up on it. The whole thing just collapsed. Come here, Gia, Mia. Come here. All right, let's check out the animatronics over here. We got Reagan. We got another pull switch. Her head's not spinning yet. Well, there it goes, and there's the face behind her coming from that digital piece in the back. <laughs> Hold my hand, Mia. There's the kid responsible for knocking down that display. What do you got in your bag there, young lady? Oh, you don't want to tell me, huh? Mr. Dark, you're not working. I just wish they made you look more realistic. Cause that's such a cool prop the bag of bones who I'm really thinking about getting come on work it's not working only issue with this place so far is none of the animatronics are working is happy bottoms working nope I believe he's working, but he's not moving. I can hear him. The back displays aren't working either. Yeah, that's the only issue with this location so far. Now I'm used to seeing the the Chucky guy here. I have not. I, I have seen Annabelle, but I have not seen the Sam. Or these. At any location. I had no time to look at the one at the flagship store because how crazy it was going. But I like that one. I, that that really looks like Sam. It comes with the flaming pumpkin too. It, it removes 
with removable light up pumpkin. Awesome. Remember back in the day it was like they had dark stuff, man. Mia, are you playing with the dolls? Those are the wrong dolls to play with, honey. <laughs> what do you got there, Mia? Little baby. You got a little baby? Yeah, Is she cute? Yeah. She's cute. That's a cat. No! There's a lot of babies baby. over there. I ran into a friend of mine, Jeremy. This guy right nice here. This guy right here has bought over a thousand dollars worth of my merchandise that the I was next selling. Next Rob Zombie. Yeah, he's the next Rob Zombie. He runs now a haunted I'm house. Out all the masks here. Look at all these masks. You got Weatherface. You got Michael Myers. You have a haunted house, right? Yeah. Ray like Rehoboth Mass. Ray Rehoboth Mass, what's your address? When you do it, when, what's the address? Uh, it's 172 Summer Street in Rehoboth, and we're doing it Saturday and Sunday nights from 7 to 10. All October? All October. All right, so you got a haunted house, 172 Summer Street, Saturdays, Fridays and Saturdays? Fridays and Saturdays. From 7.30 till whenever everyone's all done scaring, and it's free? Oh, wait, you could come in for free? three hours, whatever you want to do. I got to come check you out, man. All right. This guy bought a lot of my horror merchandise that I was having oh, for my haunted attraction. Mr. Halloween got the best stuff. <laughs> he bought a lot of stuff, so I'm dying to check it out. All right, Jeremy, thanks, bud. All right, thank you. Now, this is the first Spirit Halloween I've been to. It actually has a full-on entourage of every single mask. There's barely any empty spots, so I'm going to go through them little by little. I don't like looking at the plastic ones. With the alien Captain Spaulding, we got the Michael Myers, Jason, Jigsaw, Abraham Lincoln. Oh boy, Tallinn 5 all over again. He's got the sickle. Is that the nozzles of the clown mask? I believe so. He's got the pickle nose. The Star Wars. That looks like the pumpkin at the front of the store, I believe. You got the plague mask. Oh, I'm sorry. No worries, buddy. Some more on this wall right here. Yeah. Nothing out of the ordinary. Hey! Come on. <laughs> That's terrible. No! No! <laughs> That's terrible. No! No, they did That is terrible. There's the vintage black light. They pop Donald on those. Look what they did to Donald Trump. For Donald Trump, bro. Nothing's catching my eye over here. I haven't seen any screen masks. Alright, we got a full display of the weapons, too. They got an aluminum bat. That's cool. This is new. What is that? Oh, that's supposed to be like a hand. You put your hand in there, and it acts like you have a sore in, as your palm. This is new, a corkscrew. That's new. What's that? That looks like a real deal razor blade, too. And I think that's new, too. I'm pretty sure that's new. Let's go on to this side. We've got the very extremely popular Universal Monster Frankenstein and the creature from the Black Lagoon. I see the baby. This sword looks like it's from Final Fantasy VII. I had this. This thing was absolutely cool. Absolutely awesome. Post that on one of your yard props. 
There's another bully that looks like it's from Final Fantasy 7. Scissors. I didn't see these masks either. Laughing Jack. Sparky the Clown. Freaky Foam Clown. And Wild Eyes Clown. There's one mask that did catch my eye. I glanced over real quick, but I came back to it. This mask looks like a mix between Alien, the movie Alien, and if you've ever seen Spaceballs back in 1985 or 86, the little creature that comes out of the guy's stomach. It's called Green Alien. What are you doing? What the heck? What are you doing? Oh, you're full of craziness today. We're in a Beetlejuice section. It's full blown. What is it, honey? Full blown Beetlejuice section. There's nothing else here. What is it, honey? What are you touching? A shrunken head? Yeah. Why <laughs> would you touch that? That's just. Ooh, Beetlejuice Monopoly. Beetlejuice Monopoly. Got the doormat. Ah! Here lies Beetlejuice. I never seen this. It's a Lydia doll. And here's his wife right here. That is pretty cool, huh? Good save, sweetheart. You almost just cost me twenty dollars, Mia. This is one of my fa favorite sections of the store. I love the lighting section and the strobe lights, the fog juice, the fog machines, the battery packs. They got dropping mechanisms, fog timers, fog juice. This area is everything that we They got low lying fog juice, it's more dense. They got a low lying fog machine. Wow, that, you know what? I think this is the first year they had that. I don't remember them having that before. They got the fog holes with the adapters. I came here for one thing, the battery packs to hook up to one of my props. And I do not see it. Pumpkin string lights. There's my other two maniacs in there. We're on our way out, Mia. Are you ready to leave? Yeah. Yeah? Are you sure? Yeah. Did you get what you wanted? Yeah. What are you going to be for Halloween? Um, Elsa. Elsa. You're going to be Elsa? Yeah. Yeah? All right, we're going to go now. I had fun in Swansea. Swansea was probably the best place I've been to since Egg Harbor. Bye. You saying bye? And again, thank you to my subscribers. And the subscriber who told me to come here, Holiday Studios, thank you for recommending this place because it's definitely the best Halloween store I've been to. Besides the Egg Harbor location, again, and also my friend Jeremy that you guys seen, he really did come to my house and purchase a lot of horror merchandise for my professional haunt. Please go check them out if you're around Rehoboth, Mass, 172 Summer Street, Fridays and Saturday nights. They start at 7.30. Alright guys, and as always, check you guys out in the next video. Oh.